Yep, that's what happens when you're going too damn fast. Two car pile up right there. But hey, two car, there's like six cops. Car with the hood up. Everybody's driving like they're fucking nuts. You know, it's like if they drive without looking at their telephone and drive, just pay attention to the fucking road. You don't have to look at your telephone to drive. You know, I mean, you just keep your eyes on the road, which that's what I'm doing right now. I'm keeping my eyes on the road and my hands on the wheel. Because you just never know who's going to pull out in front of you on their cell phone in their hand. You know, just like this person right here that come flying up behind me in a van. They're flying up doing about, eh, I'd say about 45. I'm doing a little over 40. But it's just crazy. Everybody thinks that they can drive fast and, you know, they think they're multitasking. You know, you see women putting their makeup on and shit and guys shaving in the mornings. You know, and these bike riders are the ones that are getting on my fucking nerves, too. They'll ride their bicycles out in the middle of the goddamn street. They think that they, they own, you know, like the lane that they can ride their bicycle on. It's like, yeah, you know, you pay taxes and stuff, but, you know... You don't see anybody driving a car down a bike trail. You know, now that would be the fucking first. That'd be, actually, I think it can't, well, it wouldn't be funny because, well, no, it wouldn't be funny at all. But these people let ride their, their bikes in the street, though. I seen this old man one time jump out of his car. He pulled it over because this guy was riding his bike in the lane and he pulled his car over and threw something at the guy. You know, I don't blame the guy for doing it, though, the old man. Because the guy was riding his bicycle. Because you're not going to keep up pace with traffic. You know, there is no friggin' way that you're going to do that on a bike. Well, maybe some people can. I know I couldn't. My old ass would flip over the handlebars. But, uh, just come back from my dad's house. He's like day and night. I could say, hey, dad, you know, it's, it's daytime out. He'd say, hey, you know what? It's nighttime. Hey, dad. It's raining. You want me to cut the grass today and it's raining. Oh, it ain't doing nothing here. Well, I don't live in another fucking country or another state. You know. It's pouring down fucking raining. He wants me to come over and cut his grass. Then he wants to know why the lawnmower shut off. And I told him, I said, you know what? The grass is dry. That's why it did it. You know, I was being a smart ass. You know, you have to be sometimes. Because all you hear about is your... You know, your other brother, how wonderful and great he is that he brought him food, but he couldn't cut the grass because he couldn't. That's why. Why couldn't he? Because he couldn't. Oh, okay. You know, it's just like I'm the fucking shit bum of the family. But that's how it goes. You know, and all he wants to do is sit around and bitch about politics and this and that. And it's like, there is nothing to bitch about politics. They're all corrupt. They're all fucking crooked. I know for a fact.